Hello, YouTube. Hello again. I'm here in the kitchen of my house. My daughter is on the first floor. She's about to go out to walk as usual for her exercise, and I'm here in the kitchen,、uh, just preparing for. I I am actually feeding my dogs their food. I'm feeding them. They're eating some chicken. I actually don't know how to call it in English, but it is tori gara in Japanese, which means it's it's chicken, chicken, but、um, it's like mainly chicken bones. It consists of mainly it mainly consists of bones. And a little bit of flesh around it,、um, and、uh, it is originally it is sold to make chicken soup、uh, because it it is made of bones, and the bones can. I mean, when you make a soup with it,、uh, a bone. Chicken bone, the chicken bone,、uh, gives good flavors. Not only tastes, but also good flavors.、Uh, it is, it was cheap, kind of cheap, not expensive. It's pretty cheap, inexpensive, and it 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 wasn't expensive, and I loved it. And there were two,、uh, I don't know how to say it. Two body of chicken bones with a little bit of flesh, chicken flesh around it.、Um, you know,、uh, it must have come from a factory, and they remove all the all the parts, including flay. Um, I don't know.、Um, chicken wings. Uh, breasts, or thighs, or any other drums, everything.、Uh, they removed all those main parts, and then the remnants or re residue, res res residue, residue, meaning、uh, the remnant or leftover. Is the one I bought today. It, it has a neck, as well. It has a neck, neck as well. It doesn't have legs. It has a body, and some body and、uh, bones, and、uh, some flesh around it. And it it's good for making soup. I gave my I gave this, my dogs, and they usually eat raw meat, raw horse meat, raw deer meat, and sometimes raw chicken. They are okay. If we eat humans, if humans eat raw chicken, will contaminate it. And、uh, polluted, and we we will definitely have food poisoning, right? But dogs are very strong. Their gastric gastric fluids are so strong, and、uh, they can kill the bacteria with the chicken. And、uh, they are totally okay to eat raw chicken as well. It's amazing, isn't it? All right, and then they are going to have some dessert from now. After each meal, they are going to have something. Something like I'm now opening、uh, the refrigerator, and I closed it, and I put the lid. Of the yogurt on it, 
to put it away, put it in the fridge, put it back in the fridge, and then the next thing I want to take out is some vegetables. Maybe. No. Oh, they're crying. They're barking. They are crying, barking because they are so excited for me to give them some dessert, which is a piece of vegetable. Today's today's vegetable is radish, Japanese radish. Okay, here we go. The big one for the bigger dog and the small one for the smaller dog. I we have two dogs, small dogs, Pomeranian and Pomeranian mix. Both of them are boys and one is five years, uh, six years old. He turned uh, six years uh, May, on um, May this year. And it's been about three months. So he will be, he's now five years, three months. And the other is a little bit smaller. I mean, the size of his body is smaller and he's a bit younger. He is, he was born on January, 2018, meaning he is Let's see, he's now five years old and uh, exactly, precisely, he is, he was born on January. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven months, five years, seven months. All right. And today there is something, there is something I really wanted to talk about. Uh, I wanted to talk about this man I got to know yesterday on the net. I talked about a while ago, I, will, I talked about this very um, convenient website, useful website where uh, people gather and they exchange translation. I mean, some people ask translation about some sentences and some people uh, give answers to it. For example, um, what do you call blah blah blah? How do you translate this sentence into English or something like that? And some people uh, who come there, answer their question, uh, their answers, okay, answer their, give their answers. And um, about, when, when was that? When, when was it? About, yeah, it was yesterday morning. Yesterday morning, I was um, checking or looking up some translation at the site which is very useful for me too. And um, one of the people who gave his answers um, was the one I got interested in. And uh, he is a Japanese person. He's Japanese. And um, he gives his answer, ans answers or translations, sample translations on the website and uh, he has a link of his uh, website and I got interested in it. I don't know why. I don't know why I got interested in him. Probably the picture of his icon was a bit um, intriguing. It was two people. It was a picture of two people. Icon is a very small one, small round one. 
and there are two people. Two people were inside this small circle, and、um, I got interested in him because he is Japanese. This is one thing. And the other reason that I got interested in him was that I don't know, since there was a link、uh, just below his、uh, answer,、uh, so just I wanted to click it because not all the people who gave answers on the site have their links for such a,、um, some SNS, SNS site. Uh, like、uh, Twitter, website, YouTube channel, or something like that. And since not all of them have their own website, or、um, not, not all of them、um, always have、uh, the link to their sites, including YouTube.、Um, Website, Twitter, whatever, something like that. I tend to make it a rule to visit every and each URL, okay? And, and that morning,、uh, he was, he happened to be the one, and I, anyway, I visited his site. And、uh, on the website,、uh, he was, it was the, he was the website where he introduces、uh, what he does for his activities. He is actually an English teacher, English coach, and、uh, he has many,、uh, many of his YouTube videos attached, attached to the website. And、uh, I just wanted to take a look at one of them. And I, I clicked on it. And、uh, it was his video where. What was that? Yeah,、uh, it was an instruction video,、uh, like before and after, where he gave his stu- gives his students. Or people who came to、uh, take his lessons, pronunciation lessons.、Uh, actually, he's an English teacher, but main, his main sales point, or、uh, I don't know, I don't know how to say this but, in English, but、uh, his main, I don't know, feature, selling feature. Is an in pronunciation coach, okay? So that is why th- the video, video I opened was the one、uh, where he teaches his students or people or people who came to take his、uh, lecture or、uh, I mean, a seminar, okay? Who came to take his seminar?、Uh, and, uh, and he teaches how to pronounce. He actually fixes their pronunciation. And、uh, the video shows before and after of、uh, such people, like how their pronunciation. Change.、Uh, that video is something like that one. <laughs> And now my smaller dog is licking on my t shirt around my chest. And it's so ticklish and bothersome. And I can't concentrate on speaking though. He's frantically licking on my t shirt. My t shirt must have got something on it, and、uh, it must have smelled so good to him. 
and it was it must have been enticing him to him, and he can't help but licking, keeping on licking on my T-shirt. Licking on my T-shirt or licking my T-shirt? I'm not sure. Okay. Anyway, I happened to find this man, and he's an English coach, and his main job is an main job, or his strong point is an pronunciation coach. He's an pronunciation coach. That's that seems to be what he is proud of himself most. And uh, I, uh, I ended up watching one of his videos where he, his students, pronunciation, change. The pronunciation of his students, or people who came to take his seminar, uh, change. The video shows how. Uh, their pronunciation change, or will change, like before and after, through before and after. I don't know how to say this properly. Properly though, and、uh, and it, the video video was interesting because there was an. Obvious change. There was an obvious change of people, people's pronunciation, especially the first one.、Uh, she looks like a a woman in her twenties. She is pretty young, and first, before. Before she was, she took his seminar. Her pronunciation was like a typical Japanese woman speaking English. I mean, the tone of voice and、uh, the depth of her voice, and、uh, she doesn't doesn't seem to be very confident. And her pronunciation was a bit vague. But after, after image, after she took his lecture for about two hours, after she took his two hour lecture or seminar, her pronunciation changed so much. Her voice was,、uh, I don't know, stronger. And more,、um, I don't know. Now my dog, my dog is just、uh, on my lap, but he's restless, and he's constantly moving. It's so troublesome. It's so nerve wracking, and it, I can't concentrate it on it.、Um, it. Uh, I don't know. It, I don't know how to say it. It doesn't allow me to concentrate on it, though. And okay. And her voice sounded sounds more a bolder, and a pronunciation, and the depth of her voice was thicker, and deeper, and more stronger. And more dynamic, and、uh, it just sounded like. Aside from her pronunciation,、uh, she just sounded like native speaker, and probably how she voice. Must have changed. But, how he did it to her, is a secret, right? Because that's. What he does, and、uh, he cannot reveal it, right? But he does his job. He did a great job, 
and her pronunciation has changed so much. It was drastic, and it was very interesting to see. And it made me even more interested in him, and I kept reading his website, and eventually、uh, I ended up watching more and more of his videos. And、uh, that was the morning yesterday, right? I don't remember actually exactly what happened, when it happened, or something like that. But last night,、uh, pretty late last night, I couldn't sleep because I got into it. Into watching his videos at last. I started watching his live videos, two of them,、uh, which, is, which both are pretty long, like one, two hour long, or something like that.、Uh, both of them were pretty long. And it was an interesting video. I picked up both of the videos.、Uh, I watched other shorter videos also, but、uh, those longer videos, live videos, archives were very interesting to me because、uh, he, put, he put his title included something like、uh, from The middle of this video, I'll talk, I'll sp- only speak in English or something like that. So I got interested in it.、Uh, those titles attracted me. Those titles got interested in, interest, got me interested. And I started watching such long videos. And in In those videos, he is speaking in English. Yeah.、Um, mainly, he was talking to the listener in English and he reads the message typed by lis- listeners or what viewers. It's not a real conversation, but he calls it a conversation anyway. Uh, I don't think that's a conversation. That's a real、uh, one, I don't know, one, one, one on one conversation, person to person conversation, because he, only sp- he is the one who only speaks, and the other people only types. Anyway, and I heard his English. I heard, I listened to him speaking English. And I honestly, to be honest, his English sounded a bit snobbish. And、uh, I found him、uh, acting pretty cool when speaking English.、Um, His English sounded a bit ostentatious or a, a, a bit.、Uh, I don't know how to say this, but、uh, affected? He sounded like as if he was trying to sa- make himself very cool, speaking English. Or something like that. But anyway, I understood how he spoke. And then、uh, I happened to open、uh, another of his v i d e o where he speaks English from the very beginning. It's a demonstration video, uh, so uh, unlike such long live s t r e a m Archives where he speaks English, but I mean,、uh, without any preparation, improvised. 
I mean, he improvises, he plays it by ear.、Uh, such demonstration videos,、uh, in such a video, he prepares what, what to say in English beforehand, right? That's why I was able to listen to his English from a different perspective. And this time, when I first listened to him speaking English, I was like, wait, 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 something must be wrong. Something was a bit different, but I didn't understand what was different or what was. Strange, or what made it sound a bit strange? And I listened to it again from the very beginning, where he only speaks in English, and then he switched to he switches to his Japanese, though. And, and first, first thirty percent of the video, he speaks English. And、uh, the rest of the two thirds rest, two thirds of the video, the rest of the, I don't know how to say it, the rest of the video, he speaks Japanese, all right? And、uh, I tried to listen to the English part all over again. And this time, I found it, although I found it a bit strange. But I still didn't know what made it sound a bit strange. And then I went back to the live stream and I kept going to watch. I kept watching the rest. And anyway,、um, I kept watching for his,、um, Those videos for about three hours, four hours because I couldn't sleep well last night. I couldn't fall asleep. Probably, or yeah, no, not probably, but I can say that pro- it, it was because of his videos.、Um, it kept me wide awake. Anyway, since I couldn't sleep, and there are many things that I really wanted to find out or figure out by watching his videos, I kept watching. And at last, I ended up I ended up watching one part, one part where he speaks English. And I, by the time I ended up watching certain part where he spoke English pretty slowly,、uh, I already noticed something which actually made his English a bit awkward from time to time.、Uh, that was actually a R sound. His R sound, he somehow puts R sound in, in places that don't need R. I mean, he tends to put R sound even though the word doesn't have any R. I know that some Japanese people tend to do this because we are not good at making our sound proper, our sound, because we don't have any our sound in Japanese. No wonder、uh, our sound is、uh, some, one of the sounds that we、uh, are not good at making. Like, L and、uh, TH sound, or and yes, such as and including TH sound,、uh, 
uh, L sound, so, something like that. And, and since some people are struggling, struggling to、uh, make our sound properly, they tend to over pronounce their pronunciation and、uh, they ended up putting our sound into a word, even though the word itself doesn't have any R sound. In such a case,、uh, the word pronounced by them、uh, should be sounded awkward, right? Because they are not pronouncing the word correctly. And this is not about accent, okay? Or, I mean, your mother tongue accent, nuance. Um, it's not about that. It's just that they、um, pronounce the word wrongly and they even,、uh, they even don't notice about it. Unless someone teaches them that they are actually pronouncing the word wrongly. And I was so surprised to know that. Even though he's a pronunciation coach, and that's what that's his strong point, sales point, right? That, that, makes, that makes, I don't know, that's his strong, strongest sales point. But still, it turned out that he doesn't pronounce. Some words incorrectly, like the way he, the unique way, his like original way, his original way. Those words, for me, those words were not sounded like English at all. Like, like the word Malaysia, Malaysia. It's a country's name. It's the country's name, right? And he pronounced it as Malaysia. Malaysia. Yeah, he could make himself understood by other people, but especially he will be okay for native English speakers because. They are good at catching English sounds more than us who are not, who are non English native speakers. But 